Hello guys, today is the last session before your summer break. Today we are going to revise all of the values that we took before and we are going to learn some new simple things. Okay, let's go on with it. Today we're going to talk about moral values. Today we're going to talk more about morals, values, we're going to have a story time and we are going to talk about morals and values together. So, what is morals? Morals are the rules which people use to guide their behavior and thinking. When an individual is dealing with or capable of distinguishing between right and wrong. And what are values? Values is a principle, standard or quality considered worthwhile or desirable. Morals and values. If morals and values are not taught in us, we will make decisions based on immediate needs and desires, and based on emotions, not on sound of judgment. Story time. Old wise man. Once upon a time, there lived a wealthy man. He was quite successful. However, his son was engrossed in bad habits. With no more options, the wealthy man asked a wise old scholar to educate his son. Please help my son, he pleaded. The wise man agreed to help the poor boy. Soon, the old man arranged for them to walk through a park. When the old man met the boy, he took the young boy to the park for a stroll. There were many varieties of trees and plants in the park in the park. Stopping abruptly, the old man stopped at a small plant. Put that out, he told the boy. The boy easily pulled it out, wondering what was the meaning of this. Next, the old man asked the boy to do the same with some other plant. This plant was a bit bigger than the previous one. This continued and as time went by, the plants grew bigger and smaller. As the plant grew bigger and stronger, the boy began to have trouble while pulling them out. Then, at one point, the boy could no longer pull the plant out as directed by the old man. The, the poor boy tried with his might and he still failed. Impossible, he said out of breath. It is impossible to pull this plant out, the old man smiled and said, I am going to tell you something valuable. Listen to it carefully. You see, it is extremely easy to root out young plants. In the same manner, bad habits can be easily removed at a young age. As we grow, our habits become stronger, and to get rid of them, you need to apply more strength. And once the bad habits take root, it is excessively hard to rid of them. Hard but not impossible. Finally, the boy understood the meaning of the lesson and began to work on changing his ways. In the next few slides, we are going to revise some values that we learned throughout this year. 1. Responsibility. Responsibility is being accountable in word and deed, having a sense of duty to fulfill tasks with, with reliability, dependability, and commitment. 2. Perseverance. Pursuing worthy objectives with determination and patience while exhibiting fortitude when confronted with failure. 3. Caring. Showing understanding of others by treating them with kindness, compassion, generosity, and a forgiving spirit. 4. Honesty. Telling the truth, admitting wrongdoing, being trustworthy, and acting with integrity. 5. Respect. Treating others as you would want to be treated. Understanding that all people have values as human beings. 6. Courage. Doing the right thing in face of difficulty and following your conscience instead of the, ca of the crowd. What is the relationship between morals and values? Everyone encounters personal experiences which demands their choice between right or wrong. You are bound to violate the moral law if your behavioral values are not rooted and understood.
The quote of the year that I want you to live by even when you're in a break, values are like fingerprints. Nobodies are the same, but you leave them all over everything you do. I hope you enjoyed today's topic, the videos and the lessons. Thank you for watching, stay home, stay safe, have a lovely summer break and hope to see you soon. Bye-bye!